Hello everyone and welcome to the Blue Blouse channel. Now if you're new here, I welcome you and if you're old, I welcome you the same way because without you, my YouTube door would be closed. First of all, Happy New Year, Happy 2023. In today's video, we are going to play a game of empty, not empty. Basically, I'll be reviewing most of the products that I've already interviewed. Oh my gosh, my products have turned people. I am going to look at most of the products that I have already reviewed on this channel and tell you whether or not I have used them up. And if I have used them up, I'll tell you what I like about it. If I haven't used, I will tell you why I haven't use it up if you see me looking down I'm looking at my computer because I bought so many things that I don't remember half of them okay so going down from the earlier times I can see one of the first product reviews that I did was the Aussie Moist and Miracle Curls hair review now let's start with the Aussie shampoo. The Aussie shampoo is empty. Lovely shampoo. When I want a deep cleanse, I use that one. Up next would be, of course, the conditioner. The Aussie conditioner is also empty. Yes, it is empty. I love it. It gives lots of slip. Up next, we have the 3 Minute Miracle Moisture Deep Conditioner. You know the name of it. It is also empty. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Lots of slip. Now we're going to move on to the Aussie Moisturizer that I also reviewed. It is also empty. But not emptied by me. I did not like that moisturizer because it was just so light. It lasted like five minutes in my hair. It, it is empty, but it wasn't emptied by me. It was emptied by somebody else. Up next is the Alike Naturals Honey and Sage Deep Conditioner. It is da -da -da -da, not empty. And let me tell you why it is not empty. It's a lovely deep conditioner, but it is way too light for my hair type. So what I like to do with it is actually put it on my dry hair as a moisturizer. I've never seen a moisturizer like that deep conditioner, trust me. And it is a, it is taking a while for me to get it done because, you know, I have many products. But I like it as a detangler. Don't sleep on that. Aliki Naturals Deep Conditioner. If you have fine hair, I'd recommend that one. And besides, it smells awesome. I think out of all the deep conditioners, the Aliki Naturals one smells the best. Up next, we have a Shea Moisture Manuka Honey Intensive Hydration Mask. It is Pam -pam -na, empty. Let me tell you why it is empty. It is empty because it is the thickest deep conditioner that I own and it allows me to fly through knots like nobody's business. And this is one of the products that I'm actually going to purchase again. Now we're going to go and look at the Double Sheen World Class Curls Gel. It is... Pa -pa -na -na. empty it is empty but not as a result of my doing i gave it to somebody else whose hair type will curl with little to nothing on it the young lady that made use of it her hair is very silky very shiny and if you put water on her hair her hair will curl and she liked it but I didn't because all my hair did was just absorb the water from it and shrink. Up next, we have the Cantu Shea Butter Deep Treatment Mask. It is 
Dun 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 dun. No, I get copyright. Dun 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 bam bam bam. It is not empty. Let me tell you why it is not empty. It is not empty because I have too many deep conditioners and I just need to finish all of them. But the Shea Moisture was the one that was done first, then the Mango and Lime one, and I'm working on finishing the Canto Deep Conditioner as well. The Cream of Nature Pure Honey Mask, the ones that came in the sachets looking like this but it had a screw on it where is one that i haven't opened yet i haven't opened this yet can you believe it this is one out of the three that i bought and i haven't used it yet i tried one and it was okay but i wasn't moved to use the rest of these so i have two of them just sitting there i recorded the one for the avocado so my decoration just failed me like that and wow did you know that I micropore taped my decoration to the wall and I guess it succumbed to its weight I know it's on the floor but uh, we shall look past that as I was saying this mask here I recorded the avocado one and I never posted it because it feels exactly like the other one. So this one is brand new. If you know me in real life and you want to take this off of my hands, by all means, WhatsApp me. The next one that I'm seeing is the Herbal Botanicals Deep Cleansing Dual Shampoo and Conditioner. Which means that it is a gentle shampoo. That is what they mean. And by the way, they have a new conditioner and I'm open to trying it. I've seen it probably in Fantana or somewhere. But I know I've seen the conditioner somewhere. And I do appreciate that. So, the Herbal Botanicals Deep Cleansing Dual Shampoo and Conditioner is... Boop! Empty. Empty, 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 empty. Let me tell you something. You see, when I was using that shampoo, I didn't use anything else with it. And what I realized is that when using it, my deep conditioners, they performed a lot better. Because, you know, I was using the Garnier Fructis um, shampoo earlier to test the deep conditioners. By the way, you don't know if a deep conditioner is working unless you test it with a sulfate shampoo. When you test it with something that will dry out your hair and then you follow up with it, you will know if it really replenishes moisture. So once the Garnier Fructis shampoo was finished, I got to using Herbal Botanicals. I got so used to using that drying shampoo that I forgot what a moisturizing shampoo felt like. So... The herbal, herbal is completely out. I need to get another one. The next one is the Benjamin's Shampoo and Conditioner. I'm going to do both of them one time because I already know the answer. They are not empty. And the reason why they are not empty is because they hold so much. As a matter of fact, they are right beside me. I am pretty much two-thirds the way finished with each of these. Okay? I am finishing them. You know I only have one head. Right? I only have one head. And I can use so much and no more. So many are no more, no more products. But I use them on a regular and I especially use this shampoo when I want to get stuff out of my hair. So instead of using a clarifying shampoo, this Benjamin's, it will get the stuff out of your hair without it feeling too dry. All right. So they are not empty, but they are being put to good use. Up next, we have the perfect hair and skin. I think I did the castor oil shampoo with that. 
they are or it is empty empty as a big barrel from foreign and i absolutely loved that shampoo it smelled great number one and number two a little went a long way when i used it and i realized that i had great volume when i used that particular shampoo great great volume it is a little less moisturizing than the herbal one but what i loved about it volume 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 for days the next one is the honey vera shampoo set it is not empty and let me tell you why it is not empty honey vera was a little light for me it was a little light however i use the conditioner for it from time to time to actually detangle my hair i think i reached for the herbal and the um the pure skin and nails products more up next which is the last set of products that i reviewed the most affordable in the pack by a Jamaican company is Zimi. They are not empty because I just bought them. My favorites from Zimi are the styling products. The moisturizer is bomb and so is the foaming mousse. And by the way, I realized I actually bought a Zimmy product before, but I never really pay attention to the label. You know, the setting lotion that comes in a small tones bottle that you have to dilute. I actually have one of those from Zimmy. I never realized it was they that produced it. But I like their moisturizer and their foaming mousse most because my hair is very shiny and very bouncy when I use those two together especially together the mousse and the moisturizer I don't think it gets better than that I mean the mousse doesn't give you like a stiff stronghold but if you just like a soft and shiny finish that is the combo for you I encourage you to try it and what I realized with the moisturizer from Zimmy is that it doesn't have a lot of oil and it doesn't have a lot of water either. So when you put the moisturizer on your hair, your hair won't shrink. And you know my hair absorb water like a sponge absorb water. Like my hair just absorb water from most of the products that I use and just shrink up and don't know nothing. That is why I like the semi products. Styling products especially. And that is the game of... Let me put up this empty, not empty. I hope you have a wonderful rest of the year and I look forward to seeing you again. Bye. See you again next time.